السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ سین اور پریویس ویڈیو سو فار وی ہیو لرن اباؤٹ ڈفرنٹ لیٹرز ان عربک ڈفرنٹ ساؤنڈز ان عربک سو واٹ آر دا ڈفرنٹ لیٹرز اینڈ ڈفرنٹ ساؤنڈز انشاءاللہ ٹوڈے ویل بی لرننگ دا ورڈز ان عربک دا لیٹرز کم ٹوگیدر ٹو فارم ورڈز ورڈز کم ٹوگیدر ٹو فارم اے سینٹینس سینٹینسز کم ٹوگیدر ٹو فارم اے پیراگراف اینڈ سو آن اینڈ سو فور وی گیٹ books and volumes so what are the words in Arabic so Arabic has simplified and has put all the words together in three categories there are three kinds of words in Arabic so what are those we're going to learn today inshallah the first thing what we have to know is called an ismun it's called ism it's written as ismun The second word is called a fa'al, a fa'al, so fa'alun, it's called ismun, fa'alun, and the third word is called as harf, it's called harfun, so we've got ism, fa'al, and harf, so we'll be learning what does these three means. We will begin with inshallah with the easiest word to remember, and that is harf. So what is a harf? Harf is a word that makes no sense on its own. So there has to be another word to come after it to make some sense. So harf is a word that makes no sense on its own. And it has to be another word. Let me give you an example. If I just say to, doesn't make any sense. If I just say in, doesn't make any sense. Same thing on, from. There has to be more information for these words to make some sense. For example, see, say to masjid, it makes some sense. Say in the house, on the table, from India. So these are the words on their own. They don't have any sense, but there has to be another word to come after it. That is a half. Coming to fell. So what is a fell? Fail in English occurred as a verb or something which describes an action. So in Arabic, how do we recognize this word? So it is a word in which a tense is attached to it. What is a tense? Like a past tense, present tense, and you guessed it. The next one is a future tense. So let's give you some examples. So for the past tense, like he ate, they traveled. So these are the actions that describe that has been done some time before. So we have present tense, like he is writing, they are traveling. Future tense, he will be writing, they will be traveling. So that is, fa'al is a word in which you can find a tense in it. A present tense, past tense, or future tense coming to ism ism contains a lot of things there's so many things comes under the roof of ism so what are those things there's the name place could be animals things or objects adverbs adjectives and more so inshallah we'll be slowly learning everything so name place animal things adverb anything which you say which describes a name a place animal thing or adverb so that comes under the roof of ism so just give an example like name muhammad hamid ali the place makkah madina the things book table Adverb like here and there, adjective, beautiful, new, an idea, Islam, Islam is an idea, can't see it. So these are the things uh, which we have learned. Ism, fa'al, that has tense and harf, that makes no sense unless there is another word. So let's do some 
practice inshallah see if you can recognize these things if I give you a sentence I want you to read this and figure out what is a nism what is a fi'al and what is a half if I say Muhammad is going to masjid so what will be the ism what will be the harf what will be the fa'al so we have Muhammad will be ism going is fa'al to is a harf and masjid is a ism let's give another example see if you can figure it quickly you are learning Arabic so what will be ism what will be fa'al and what is if there is any harf in this see here there is no harf in this a simple sentence it says you is a ism or learning Arabic so if you see here is and are there is no is and are in Arabic so this is what we are going to learn in next session inshallah how to recognize these things so if I give you last one today inshallah so if I say I am teaching Arabic from computer so if you can figure out what is ism what is a fa'al what is a harf good 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 so I is a ism teaching is an action it's a fa'al Arabic is a ism from is a harf and computer is an ism so inshallah remember this thing ism fa'al harf and slowly we'll be learning about we'll begin our journey with ism inshallah and then we'll continue okay assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh